Hey y'all, hey, so today is day 30th of God Teach Me How to Love My Future Husband. I am sad, but I'm happy at the same time. Like we literally made it to day 30th and I'm super excited to see what God is going to do in us and through us. Trust me, we don't have it all figured out. This was a challenge to get us started on the journey of all the things that God has desire for us to be and to become. So I'm telling you, if you fail yesterday, pick yourself back up and continue this journey. The Bible says that the righteous man falls seven times, but he gets up. And I need you to get up. Throughout this whole thing, get up. So today's day 30th. Let's get it. So on day 30th, which is today, it's not going to be a prayer. It's just going to really be affirmations into who we are and who God has called us to be. So on day 30th of God, teach me how to love my future husband. On day 30th, I commit to be a better person. I commit to be a better future wife. I commit to be a better mother. I commit to being slow to speak and to work on my emotions, to work on my attitude. If there's any areas in me that needs to be eradicated, I pray. I am praying towards that, that God will eradicate it. On day 30th, it's really about bringing it all full circle and saying, God, continue to work in me. Continue to make me the woman that I am. I am called and destined to be for you and also for my future husband and my future family. I desire to truly be a Proverbs 31 woman. So on day 30th, we made it. We did it. So affirm yourself of everything that God said that you